Today, don't look at my nugget nails. I am getting ready to put some press on nails and I kind of just buffed and shined my nail a little bit because from the last press on I had. Um, I'm going for press on nails because they don't really damage my nail bed as much as the acrylics or any other. Okay any other nail set so uh, it's press on for me guys i'm so sorry but i will do a video on my press on so wait for that yay okay so declutter i have so much so many crap oh my gosh these are like outdated ready to be tossed i don't know sometimes <clears throat> don't judge me because Sometimes I like to keep things a little over there. Expiration date. Guilty. Over here. Don't judge me because I know y'all do too. So, whatever. So, here. <clears throat> you guys, this is one of those, like, kit that they have. It comes with, like, these little... I was like, I was loving these for a minute. So I bought the bigger version, but then I ended up like not liking it. And this is like busted, but I still kept it. So that is that. I mean, some of these stuff I am going to throw out and maybe end up. See, this one's dry. Oh no, this one's okay. Maybe end up giving some away if you do want them and you don't mind a little, little expiration date. Put this away. Okay. Too many brush. And these Sigma brush. Okay. So these Sigma brush, it's like a hit or miss for me. And I, I mean, when I first um, ordered them, I thought they were everything. Like, you know, like you were going off with the trend and all of that you guys i mean they are like good but you know them drugstore ones are good like real techniques or morphe or you know like equal tools some of them are way better than these name brand ones i'm just saying <clears throat> love you sigma <laughs> Okay, but anyways, yeah, we are going to, and I gotta wash this. Look at this. Whoo, she's a mess. So, we are going to declutter some of the stuff here. I mean, I did just wash some of my brushes. So, we are going to organize some. I had one of these. Oh my God, this is really bad. Right back. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to put my brushes back in here. I did wash them, but right now we are just trying to work through some things. Oh, and I love these too because these are that um, Alamar. Is it Alamar? Alamar. It's from um, one of my boxy term subscription, and these worked really well. The brushes are so soft. Yes, honey. Okay, and this is like a contour, but I find that like it's not necessary. You can just contour with like 
one of these this is the best like and you guys this one i used it like for years and i still love them because it contours my face and why why throw them away you know this is an elf so i will definitely be washing this but let me just try to fit my brush up in here and <laughs> my blush brush you don't really need like a fancy blush blush brush you just need something like this this is yep my f15 duo fiber powder blush brush or whatever this is also elf i still keep these my eyebrow and my eyeshadow pencils i love this too like for uh, underneath to set my powder underneath the eye. Have you guys ever tried these? These are like the, um, what is that? You see that? That's the eyeliner. And then you guys on the other end, if you cannot draw a wing eyeliner, I suggest one of these, a stamper. Baby, they'll get the job done like. And then you just guide yourself from there. You see that? That's that wing. And then you can just guide yourself from there. It helps when once upon a time when I didn't know how to wing my eyeliner, but now I do just freehand. You live and you learn. That goes here. Oh yeah, I need to wash this. This is my edges for my edges. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I see I look, I look disgusting and you're not gonna be seeing my face. You are gonna have to wait on that. And you can see my, um, <laughs> My ring light stand this is ridiculous okay anyways we're just gonna try to organize a little bit I'm not gonna do too much because I don't have that many space on this um, bathroom vanity so that is done that's kind of like how I have my situation going here and it fit and then Let's do this next, cause baby, ooh, these are dusted, hunty. Okay, so these are my lips. Oops, let's put this away. Okay, so I have some name. I have more in the other room. My uh, um, office, off, off. I said office. I meant my office um slash beauty room. See, you eat too much fish. That's why you'd be like off fishing. Okay, so this is ColourPop. I like this color. I mean, I used it like once. You guys, look at it. Barely even touched it. I might give some of these away if you guys want them. So if you want them, comment down below the ones that I'm going to put aside. But if you do want them, let me know. And this is like... We're Milani's. I love Milani's color pop. Yes, yeah, this is so cool. Okay. This is one of those uh cream lipstick. They're they're like Hank and Henry's from one of those boxy boxy charm. Tell me why. Look at this. You guys. It pops out like you see that? And baby, isn't she lovely? Oh my gosh, she's gorge. Look at this. I love it. I don't know. I don't know why my ring light's not working. Sorry if it's a bad quality video right now, but I don't care. I well, I do care, but what can I do when something's not working for me right at the moment? And this one is a moisturizing lipstick in the shade Never Give Up Chestnut. And this is, um, yeah, that's one of those boxy charms, I think. 
I got a lot of boxy trunks. I, I need to stop. This is Revlon. I like this. It glides on really nice. I I I buy from like drugstore to high end to I'm if the product if something's like good quality, count me in, baby. I'm there. I don't judge or I don't. Wet and wild. See, and I got this for like ninety something cents at Walgreens. I don't care. And these are my Mac. Yeah, I do splurge. I I do have like the YSL set too, but it's in the other room. This is the ones that are here. This NARS one is very pretty. See, I end up getting really dirty when I do these makeup declutter crap. And then this one is also a L'Oreal Paris. Beautiful, beautiful, honey. Look, ooh, ooh, honey. Look, and then this one is Revolution Pro. Look at this. You like matte? I like matte. And then this is Kylie Jenner. You want that? So I usually put like a. This is just like from Walmart, Maybelline, the brown. You guys remember these? Um. <laughs> Lip liner from high school high school back in the day, like oh my god, oops. Oopsie. Back in the day, like these lip liners were everything. We would just line our lip and just don't put anything in the middle and just go. So I put this and then my Morphe, of course. I like the Morphe. You guys look, it's ugh, I'm sorry, but I use this the most. I use these combo the most. And the Kylie Jenner one. It's like light. Yeah, I put it over my brown and liner and everything like that. Another Morphe. It's, um, what's this? It's called, Me it's Mega Matte Super Matte. It's Goosebumps. Beautiful, honey, beautiful. Okay, hold on, this one. And this is a red one that I, so one of my old videos that I did a uh, ma makeup haul or something on, I don't know, like maybe two years ago. You guys, I still, like I said, I still keep these, so don't judge me. But they are so, like, it's so beautiful. Do you not see this? I, I love this color. I combo it with that NARS, and my lipstick is popping, honey. Like, these two, gorge, done. And then I do have my Ruby Woo as well, and it's Retro Matte Ruby Woo. I love this. It's, like, my go-to. You guys, I'm telling you, it's perfect for every skin tone. I don't care if you orange, yellow, green, or blue, baby. That Ruby Woo and with the the a lipstick pencil, the Ruby Woo lip pencil crayon, perfect. It's That's the combination. And then I do have this too. It's pink plaid. My MAC. Yeah, I, I ran through these, kind of. Lots of Mac. I do want to do, oh, oh you guys. <laughs> my one time I wore this, my mom was like, why are you so, uh, <laughs> are you outside in the cold? Because it's like purple. Oh my God, that was hilarious. Anyways, um, that's that. Let's just put some, put it nice. I, I, I do need, I don't have wipes right now, but my earrings, what is it doing here? Okay. Oh. No wipes to wipe anything right now. We're just gonna try to organize a little bit, not too much, cause I'm lazy. I am lazy at the moment, hunty. Cause I just finished a workout. I cycle, I cycle, I cycle about 20 minutes a day. So, or depending on if I'm feeling it, Baby, I'm hitting that uh, hour and 15 minutes. Getting my sweat on. I say these. So, I might do a giveaway. So, if you guys want some makeup, holla at your girl down below if you don't mind. <laughs> a little outdated. 
because some of these I don't use and I'm not just going to give you, I mean, you want it, you want the ones I use. I mean, baby, go for it, but we will, why is the light flickering? See, I'd be scaring myself like when, when my husband go to work, I'm scared. Like anything flicker or I just be that person. Oh my God, these are so, and you guys, I, okay, so this is almost done. So see these, these, these I don't use. I just test them. I don't use. You guys can see. I can give away this. And it's still it's still good, you guys. I don't... I mean, what is the day? There's nothing. But it's still good. I, I don't know. And this, I haven't even opened them yet. You see it? Brand new, baby. You see, I'm just... These are all from... And look, I haven't even used this either. You see, this is why I have a problem. Well, it's not a problem. I mean... It is a problem <laughs> talking to myself. So those can be uh, in a giveaway or something. Holler down below because these I won't be using. If you want them, let me know. So put that back in there. Bro, this light is, what is your problem? What the heck? Don't be scared. And this NARS, I mean, okay, my, so in the summertime, I get really dark. And then wintertime, I get really like, that's everybody. But I use this like, it's a radiant creamy concealer. I use this like maybe once or twice. I mean, it's still good. Oh, we're not going to throw it away. I, I'm a hoarder. I use this to um, my eyebrows are fuzzy peach hair, peach fuzz. It's the Japanese, is it Japanese? Japanese, whatever. I and I'm Asian. I don't even know how to pronounce. And this is good for like your conceal that eyebrow. And I like this Anastasia one, the brow gel. So this will go in. I have a lot of these spoolies also because I used to do um eyelash extension and I don't anymore. It's like time consuming and all that. You have to be really dedicated. I, I mean I do it to myself once in a while. See, sorry. So I do I like give myself some individual lashes. If I prefer to, I, you know, I have this big old, this mag is carrying like a handheld, like a stand mirror, but you flip to the outside. It makes your fit like a magnifying, um, mirror. And I use that to do my, um, eyelash extension. And you guys, my favorite, 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 favorite mascara. I don't care. I have the NARS. I have the Tarte. I have all of those, but I, I still use L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. Maybe you can't go wrong with those. And I love this too. This is like that lip combo that I do like with that brown pencil eyeliner. Okay, so now we're going to put this away. Okay, so. <sighs> Favorite, um body lotion besides my Shea Moisture uh, Coconut Virgin Extra Virgin Oil. This is my go-to. I put this on right after, well, kind of like uh, maybe 30 minutes after I shower because I want my skin to dry a little. I pat dry my skin. And then I put these on. And I also, this is my favorite for my face. My go-to right now, it helps clear my skin up. I don't know what it is with this. You guys, this helps scare, uh, cure whatever blemish I have. It, like, makes my face, um, the tone or the color of my skin, like, it just 
clear like it's just clear i don't know who, how, how else to say it it just helps and with oh well the dove um the dove um wash, the dove sensitive skin wash face wash as well that i use for my face okay so we have this now there's nothing much to do here this is just some random so how i grew my lash I don't really do lash extension because I'm so bad at it. And I feel like when I put lash extension on, I my eyes immediately go like cross-eyed. Like it just goes crossed-eyed. And I feel like there's something on my eyes giving me a headache. But when I do wear lash extension, I'll, I'll go for like a wispy light band where it's not too heavy on my eyelids. But I do have long lashes, so thank God for that. But I use I used to use it on my... um the like, you know, the water line, not water line. Don't get that in your eye. It'll cause like horrendous or something. But yeah, you make, I use this to grow my eyelashes, but I don't use it anymore. So that stays in. These are some samples. This is another blade. I'll just put that here. My favorite, you guys, I have all kinds of like um foundation, like from NARS to MAC to Tarte to Too Faced, to Estee Lauder, or whatever, or Giorgio Armani, and I still end up with the drugstore. You guys, this, the Stay, the Super Stay Active Wear Maybelline New York, thir up to 30 hours. This is my favorite, and it doesn't budge, it doesn't, when you take pictures, it looks like skin, and I only do one pump, I don't, I don't really do my but much makeup like I used to this is almost gone I love this so this uh, luminous setting spray I did a video back in the day like two years ago when while uh, that makeup haul video this Madison you guys this Madison setting spray it gives you that once you spray it on it gives you that um nice glow like it's a illuminating glow it's so pretty on your skin and then I do have this as well. This is from um, Hydration Happy. It's Mana Kadar Skincare. It's Hydration Happy Hydrating Face Mist. I put this on first, let it sit, and then at the end when my makeup and everything's like, okay, set and, you know, I once over with this and ready to go. And it stays all night. Don't forget, I, let, I used to use this a lot because my face, but then after I found those two combination, I barely touch this now. And this is like a blemish breakthrough. I used to use this too, and it's off, and it works. Works just fine, you guys. It doesn't have to be high-end. I mean, if you want to be bougie or whatever, go ahead, go for it. But baby, if you want that budget, beauty on a budget, go to the drugstore they have a lot of i used to use this too when out like summer it's like tinted moisturizer got all this yucky makeup because i go to it too it's like spectrum spf um 20 and then it's four in one tinted moisturizer cream hydrant this one this pure one i use that a lot too and you guys i use <laughs> This is my favorite. It's the Murray's Edge Wax. It's premium gel. This is what I used to do my edges. So get you some. Perfect. All right. Let's go on to. There's nothing much here. Moisturizer. Don't forget to go get this. This works. I mean, I'm not telling you guys to like always consult with your doctor or your dermatologist or whoever, but this works for me. So everybody's skin is different. So. Is a trial and error for everybody, but this works for me as of right now. And then um, for my hair, um, right out the shower, like maybe five minutes or so. Ooh, so dusty. Okay, so I like using this Tresemme Keratin Smooth Shine. Helps my hair. Um, I do like maybe a couple of pumps and then run it through my damp hair let my hair air dry and 
I don't really use too much heat on my hair no more because, ooh, the damage. Just let it air dry. I like, I, I, my hair is like those wavy, natural wavy, um, like beach waves. Yeah, I just go for that now. That kind of look, I don't really do much anymore. Okay, let's go organize these now. So we're going to try to hurry and I'll do another video on my um, face mask and vitamin C's and stuff and my little fridge that I have right here. And it has like my vitamin C, my eye cream, my everything in here. I keep it cool because when once I do like my face mask or something like that, it helps just that hydration and that cooling helps the inflammation or your face depuff or something like that. But you guys, I really don't really, these are, some are from my favorite. Some are from BoxyCharm, some are from Milani's, Target. Gorgeous, right? I don't really use this. I barely touched this. This Caliente Artis Couture, I barely touched this. Look at that, isn't it gorgeous? Pretty, I don't know, giveaway, maybe? Or an Ace Butte, is it Ace Beauty or Ace Bew falling for you? Another gorgeous one. I barely touch this, I use this the most. I barely do makeup now, I'm so into makeup, like, as you grow, as you age, it's like, eh, you're, I, I mean, I just swat, swatch some of these. Um, and then this I like this for like fall maybe like a smoky brown eye and this one is also Zoeva Spice of Your Life that one and then this is Morphe Manny Makeup he has the whole highlighter and eyeshadows and then I like this Iconic London as well. This one, this Iconic London. So dusty because I don't really use them. Iconic London. They're like that. I barely use, I use this a lot, this one. I'm more of a nude. I go for, I just go nude brown, taupe, mauve. Like that's me. And then I use this a lot. Maybe one day I will do a how I do my makeup. We'll see. That's a lot. I use this a lot. It's almost gone. Don't judge me. <laughs> Especially this one. Maybe it's like um, she only went for that one. Yep. And then I use this a lot as well. Well, some of them. Well, this one broke. But these highlight. Oh, my God. Perfect. It's Trend Beauty Unicorn Dust. See, I don't really go for like name brand, name brand, but look at this. I use this a lot as well. This is my everyday. And this is uh, Morphe as well, Fierce by Nature. This one, it's lots of color choices. I thought they were pretty and they were like 10 at that, that time they were like 10 bucks at Target. This one I got at Target, I think. Yeah, it's at Target. And then I got this from Ulta Nikita Dragon. I showed this last time in my my video that I said that's two years ago. <laughs> Maybe I keep everything and this is like a 12 month. <laughs> Don't judge me. I don't, know if, I don't care. I'm not going to throw these away. They're like cute. So that is all I have right now. I'm trying to organize a little bit. I don't have much to. I need to wash my brushes and my... I have like three packs of this. They're like two in a pack and they're from Target. My daughter's room. She uses them too. And you guys, my my um 
go-to um, press-on nails right now are these kits from Target. So I have, I made a short video and these are like, they look like, oh my God, these, these last me like two weeks and a half maybe. If you put it on right, you file your nail just right and you put the glue on just right and don't do like, I mean, you do the housework and stuff, but you know, just kind of be careful. It'll last you longer. These are my go-to. Yeah, so that is it. Um, I will come back and do a press on nails or whatever. Oh yeah, you guys, I, I got these two. Color switch. So if your brush is dirty and you like, you need like, you, you just like this, like that. And the colors, and then you can just do a color switch. And this one as well, dry makeup brush cleaner right here. I have two of them. One of them is, well, no, actually both of these are from, from BoxyCharm. I think, yeah, I don't know. Well, maybe, I don't know. But there they are. These are my two. And my favorite, um, I think this is a dupe for, I do have a Laura Mercier, but it's in my other room. I think this is a dupe for Laura Mercier Cover Girl Trans, uh, Clean Professional Loose Powder. Favorite. This is almost gone. So this is my favorite. It do has like a little poof in there, but I don't use that. I use, I use it when I do my concealer and then I put the powder on top of the, underneath my eye. Call it a day. Favorite. I go to. All right. Thanks, you guys, for watching. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, until next time, I'll probably uh, post a press on mail video. Thank you, guys. Love you. Bye.